to be a tricky race, really. Um, we're struggling for traction, but I think that's across the field. But we've got, a, you know, we've, we've made a confident step forward from all weekend, really, and we're, we're happy to go into the race and give it a best shot for the overall win. We'll just uh, try and make a good start, push as hard as we can, and hopefully uh, force others into errors. But I think the car's looking pretty good, and, um, you know, if we have a reliable run, I think we're on for a strong finish. I think it's going to be a really tough race, race of attrition, um, and it's all going to be about driver concentration and how well they can uh, hang on for the duration of the race. The heart rates are rising a little bit, you know, the pressure is starting to mount, but um, you know, we're starting from a great position. There's only two rows of cars in front of us, so um, hopefully by you know by the time we get underway, we'll be right up there and uh, and pushing for the win. We really want to finish it off with a win, so um, so aggression throughout the team. Everyone's going to have to keep the focus six hours worth. So yeah, it's going to be tough, but uh, we're looking forward to it. earlier which has cost us a lot, lot of time and uh, it's you know it's a shame really because we put us out of contention really for, for second place but we're going to finish the race uh, but now it's a question of going out enjoying ourselves and just uh, finishing the race hopefully. Great drive, great drive all day every one of you, you all drove really well, never gave up, such hard work getting the car back out, well done all of you. To be in this position and to be fighting for the overall championship win for the last round says testaments to the hard work we've done with all our partners this year and to us as a team and the drivers we've all worked incredibly hard to get where we've got and uh, I think we can be very proud of what we've achieved this year. It was quite hot out there so it's quite physically demanding. Um, a lot of wayward drivers at times, which made it more interesting and fun, but that's all part and parcel of endurance racing, isn't it? Thoroughly enjoyable day, and uh, okay, the overall result wasn't there, but it's not due to a, a lack of hard work and effort. It's always disappointing not to be on the podium, but um, second place in the championship's a good result, considering the pace of the car that we've, we've had really this year. We knew it was going to be tight championship-wise, um, particularly for second place, and it was you know we had to we had to get on and have to score points. So they did a great job. Um, I think probably surprised a few people when they saw the car coming back out after it came into the pits, billowing smoke and on fire and what have you. But um, now I was incredibly proud of them. They did a great job today. Yet again, Johnny and Danny and Nick just never relented and just kept pushing until the very end and we just kept pushing just kept pushing and I think we closed the gap to within 12 seconds by the end of the race um, never gave up and in the end it's you know we, we've managed to sneak home with um, second in the championship so uh, disappointed not to have taken the, the big prize but very very proud and somewhat satisfied with, with second but we'll, we'll move on to bigger and better things now.